from safety grounds. The mall's murderer, Myra Hindley, is reported to be seriously ill with a chest infection. Hindley, who's 60, went into hospital earlier this month. She was jailed for life in 1966 with her lover, Ian Brady, for her involvement in the murder of three children. And the trial of Ian Huntley and Maxine Carr is to take place at the Old Bailey in London. The couple are charged in connection with the deaths of the Cambridgeshire schoolgirls, Holly Wells and Jessica Chapman. Philip Studd has the sport. And today's draw for the last 16 of the Champions League has thrown up some predictably difficult ties for all three of the English teams involved. Arsenal's task looks... Uh, and when I watched the draw this morning, it makes me regret that uh, we've had chance for the second group stage because it looks like... Uh, getting uh, better and better every year. Well, Manchester United face a couple of familiar foes in group... Uh, very welcome. He's a much beloved person. He did a great job with Barcelona. Uh, he's a person that uh, is much loved in Barcelona. So, delighted to, to have again the opportunity to, to see uh, Mr. Bobby Robson with us. I think that's the kind of match both players and the people, the, the fans, like to see. So, we're, we're looking forward to see Newcastle uh, soon in, in Barcelona. Incidentally, Craig Bellamy has been confirmed as being ruled out of Newcastle's team to face Southampton in the Premiership this weekend. He's still got a knee problem and he only needs to play one game a week, according to his doctor. He may also miss Wales' Euro 2004 qualifier against Azerbaijan next week for the same reason. Well, Liverpool's first taste of the UEFA Cup pits them against Vitesse Arnhem of Holland. Fulham face Hertha Berlin, Leeds play Malaga and Celtic's task looks the hardest. They play Celta B of Spain. Liverpool incidentally have been made the 6-1 to one favourites to win the cup for the second time in three years. Now Juan Carlos Ferrero's straight sets win today over Yuri Novak ensure that they'll definitely be a Spaniard in the final of the Masters. Well, he thought of that. 